I think just the time spent together as friends was, uh, you know, educational for the both of them. You know, uh, obviously, Tabe, his, you know, their their father has not been around. Um, mm -hmm. So he's kind of been Papa Bear growing up. Uh, so while she's his little sister, she's also, you know, his best friend. And so they've been hunting together and he's been showing her things, you know, throughout their lives. And uh, so he's, you know, he's protective, but he's also very proud. And it was uh, exciting for, to be able to portray that. ¿Qué lección de vida le deja tu personaje, Tabe, a Dakota? One of my favorite things about Tabe was, uh, He's kind of like he's kind of like native John Wayne. He's a, he, uh, he he when it comes time there comes a time when you need to stand your ground even if that means you know it might not work out the way that you want it to and uh, just having that bravery uh, to stand in the midst of something difficult and do what you have to do anyway um, really stuck out to me. En una conmovedora escena le dijiste a Naru que ella siempre veía cosas que tú no. ¿Qué tipo de cosas, por ejemplo? Naru, you know, she's very, she's, she's smart, you know, so she examines things from behind where Tabe, sometimes he goes in first, you know, he goes in before really examining the situation. So he, he really admires that about her, that she, she looks at things sometimes before she acts, you know, she's patient and um, you can really change the outcome of things if you just take some time to to uh, examine the situation. Cuéntanos sobre algo grandioso sobre Prey para ti. Oh, uh, the Predator, his, uh, his, his weapons, I think are really cool. He's got that, that uh, bolt gun in this one, and uh, that spear is pretty, pretty deadly. Um, I really, I really like his, his weapons on this movie. Uh, uh, more so than the shoulder cannon in previous movies. I thought it was just a little more involved um, and I was happy about that.